Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Kind of low energy today. Yeah, we had a rough go at it last night. Airbnb rents out a few other rooms in the place, and uh, we had some travelers just kind of shake our doorknob and try to get in at midnight. Cause they got the wrong room. They proceeded to cook themselves dinner and loudly shower <laughs> between like 1 and 2 a.m. So we just didn't really sleep last night very well. Uh, but today we're gonna take a short train to uh, Slovakia. Yeah. That's the name of the city? Bratislava. I hope we're pronouncing that right. Uh, we were just gonna spend the, the day kind of exploring it a little bit. Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. Me too. It's really nice after a one hour train ride. We're in Slovakia and we're trying to figure out where to go right now. So we have no no uh, no idea. We're trying to catch our bearings. Bratislava. 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 <laughs> We're gonna walk towards Old Town. And hopefully find something to eat. I was starving. Yeah, me too. Uh, side note though, it is super cool that you can get on a train in Europe and only an hour away you're in a totally different country. We've never experienced that before. feel pretty good about that, don't you? I do. You can't miss any. And I got some kind of traditional Slovakian dumpling. So. Cheers. This is their homemade beer. It is homemade. It's two euros. So. Not better than the five euro we got yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I got. And this is what Tia got. <laughs> so it's like a dumpling with dill sauce bacon and it's filled with goat cheese. That sounds good. <laughs> Alright, so mine is roast beef and a sour cream dill sauce with bread. That looks really good. This, this is my favorite food so far. Really? It's so good. Oh my god, so good. That's easily some of the best food we've had on this whole trip. That was amazing. It was probably like the favorite dish like ever. <laughs> the dumplings were so good. The stuff you got, the sauce, it was like a dill, like a creamy dill sauce. It was a little bit sweet, super creamy. Oh my god. We almost like, we were just sitting there contemplating order second, the second round. It was so good. so little on it. So 300 years ago, the Hungarian kings were crowned in Bratislava, and these little guys mark the coronation trail they used to walk. That's pretty cool. Yeah. So this thing right here, <laughs> that's uh, St. Michael's Gate. It is under construction, which does seem to be our luck uh, throughout Europe. Oh. Oh, there's one of those little, <laughs> one of those little train things. 
but when you can see it, what, there's um, four gates, there were four gates that mm -hmm. would guard the city, and yeah. this is the last one standing. I'm sure it's really cool. Mm -hmm. So this is the Primazialni Palace. Really pink building. It's very pink. Um, it's famous for being the location where Napoleon signed a treaty that basically dissolved the Holy Roman Empire. <laughs> so we did read that Bratislava has some interesting architecture and this bridge is one of those things. It's supposed to look like a UFO and if you really look closely at it, it kind of looks like the UFO is like sucking up the bridge. <laughs> I guess you can see that. That's pretty strange. So this behind us is Bratislava Castle. Yeah, there's a little bit of a climb to get here, which <laughs> Chibiu made a fuss about. Oh, <laughs> you've already seen Tia was the one making the fuss. You get just an awesome view of the whole city from up here. Mm -hmm. It's on the top of a hill. It's really cool. I'm always trying to get Tia to sit on a ledge with me and she doesn't, she won't sit on ledges. I'm so sorry. Come here. Close enough. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Your legs off? You don't have to if you're really uncomfortable. There you go. I love you. Hi. Love you. Can we go get dinner now? I was waiting for you. These are nice. Okay, I'm going. Are you coming? Do you need help? Okay, so a weird culture shock thing that we've both had coming to Europe is that almost every park has chairs. <laughs> and they're just public chairs just sitting there that you can use. If there were chairs sitting in a park in the US, they would be stolen, for sure. <laughs> We're at another restaurant. So Tia got uh, some kind of chicken soup. We said traditional Slovakian chicken soup. And I got <laughs> chicken in like a creamy pepper sauce with gnocchi. And sour cream? And sour cream. Like a dill cream. We're gonna do It's really these. good. Bratislava mm -hmm. has excellent food. So we just ate there and it was amazing. It was really good. I was still kind of full from lunch, so I had the chicken soup, and it was very good. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, though, I'm kind of just saving room for dessert. Yeah, that's that's the real reason. Thank you. What's wrong with this picture? <laughs> <laughs> it feels weird. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, that's better. <laughs> so you got cheesecake ice cream. Yeah. With um, some passion fruit, a little drizzle on top. Pretty good. And only a real 50. Today was a great day. I love Bratislava and I wish we had a lot more time to explore yeah. Slovakia. People are super nice. Yeah. The food's also really good. Like I yeah. really like Slovakian food. So we're definitely gonna have to come back here one day and spend a lot more time. Yeah. But for now you guys, good night. Good night. We're gonna show you guys the castle. Isn't it incredible? Wow. 